Hello kids, today's video topic is meiosis. So meiosis, what is meiosis? Meiosis is a process of cell division, okay? And it is known as reductional division because the daughter cells are produced, they have half number of chromosome than parent cell. So the chromosome number is reduced. That's why it is called reductional division. Here one diploid cell form four haploid cell. It is found in reproductive cell and help in formation of gametes. And it get completed in two cycle, meiosis one and meiosis two. So here is a cell. This is diploid cell. This divide and form two haploid cell by meiosis one. Then these two haploid cell divide and form four haploid cell. Okay, four haploid cell by meiosis two. So the daughter cell which are produced, they have half number of chromosome than parent cell. So it is reductional division. Here is meiosis one and meiosis two. Meiosis 1 go through four stages, prophase 1, metaphase 1, anaphase 1, telophase 1, which is followed by cytokinesis. Then two cells are formed. Then two cells enter into interkinesis, which is a short-lived phase. Here no DNA replication take place. Then it quickly enter into meiosis 2. Meiosis 2 also have four stages, prophase 2, metaphase 2, anaphase 2, telophase 2 and cytokinesis kinesis and then four cells are formed. So first we will learn about meiosis 1. Meiosis 1 first stage is prophase 1. It is more complicated and the lengthy process. It takes place in five steps. Leptotene, jagotene, pachytene, diplotene and dikinesis. So first the stage of prophase 1 is leptotene. Here the condensation of chromosome begins. Then jagotene. Here a synaptonemal complex form. So this is the chromosome. Okay. With sister chromated. This is one pair of chromosome. Okay. Here I'm taking this this pair okay and between the non-sister chromatid of homologous chromosome a chemical bond is formed that is called synaptonemal complex and this chromosome together called bivalent or tetrad why tetrad because one two three four arms are present then after jagotene pachytene here the crossing over take place and dna get exchanged by non sister chromatid here you can see this crossing over take place with the help of recombinase enzyme then diplotene so here the synaptonemal complex dissolve okay but the chromosomes are attached at the place where crossing over take place so x like structure is formed that is called ks meta after diplotin dikinesis here nuclear envelope breakdown nucleolus disappear okay and centrosome move to the opposite pole and the condensation of chromosome is done here prophase end after prophase 1, metaphase 1. So prophase 1 cell enter into metaphase 1. Here chromosomes are aligned at metaphase plate and spindle fiber attached to it. Then anaphase 1, here spindle fiber get shortened and chromosome pulled apart. Then telophase 1, here nuclear envelope assemble around the chromosome and a furrow is formed. Then cytokinesis, here one cell divide into two cells and both cells are haploid. Okay, so here the meiosis one is done. Then cell enter into interkinesis. Okay, a short-lived phase and quickly enter into meiosis two. 
Now let's see meiosis 2. Here is the meiosis 2. Both the cells enter into meiosis 2 prophase 2. Here competition is done. Condensation of chromosome done. Then cell enter into metaphase 2. Here chromosome aligned at the metaphase plate and spindle fiber attached to it. Then cell enter into anaphase 2. Here the spindle fiber get shortened and sister chromatid pulled apart. Then telophase 2. Here nuclear envelope are formed around the chromosome. Okay. Then cytokinesis. Here each cell divide into two haploid cells. So four haploid cells are formed. Meiosis 2 is complete. So let's see both the meiosis 1 and 2 together. Here is interface. Cell during interface DNA is copied. Then cell enter into prophase 1. Here chromosome pair up and crossing over take place. Also condensation is done. After prophase 1, metaphase 1, here chromosome align at the metaphase plate, spindle fiber attached to it. Then anaphase 1, chromosome pulled apart to the opposite poles. Then telophase 1, nuclear envelope form around the chromosome. And cytokinesis, one cell divide into two cells with the help of formation of furrow. So then these two cells enter into prophase 2. Here meiosis 2 begin. Okay. So in prophase 2, the condensation is done. Nuclear envelope break down. Then metaphase 2, here chromosome align at metaphase plate and spindle fiber attached to it. Then anaphase 2, here the sister chromatid pulled apart and moved to the opposite poles. Okay. Then telophase 2, here nuclear envelope assemble around the chromosome and furrow is formed. Then cytokinesis and each cell form 2 to haploid cells. So four daughter cells are formed which are haploid. Okay. One thing to remember that in anaphase 1, chromosome pulled apart and in anaphase 2, sister chromatid pulled apart. Also, that in prophase 1 is most complicated process and here crossing over take place with the help of enzyme called recombinase. So, the topic is done. I hope you like it. Please like, share, subscribe my channel. Thank you.